You're watching MMM on New Nintendo News. Oh, mm -hmm. This is a gaming show where we keep you up to date with the latest Nintendo related gaming news. And sometimes we also cover PlayStation 5 and Xbox Series X. X don't give it to you. We do. On today's show, guys, the, the Switch 2 has been leaked. We have images of the Switch 2. We know what it's going to look like. I mean, to be honest, these are all rumours that we're about to discuss, so take it with a heavy pinch of salt. However, I am convinced that this is it. This is it. The Switch 2 is coming. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Switch 2! I mean, it seems like every other day I see a video on YouTube of someone talking about the Nintendo Switch 2. And don't get me wrong, I'm excited for it, I'm waiting for it. It is one of the most hotly anticipated gaming consoles in, in the longest time. Like, people are waiting for it, I get it, there's a buzz around it. But just because Joe Blocks from across the world starts mouthing out and saying that the Switch 2 is going to have a 59 inch screen and backwards compatibility with every single Nintendo system ever produced, does it make it so? Does it make it so? I have actually tried to avoid reporting all of these Switch 2 leak rumours because to be honest, if I did report on them, I, I wouldn't be able to keep up because there's not enough time in the day to make enough videos to report about every single Nintendo Switch 2 leak that has occurred. However, this leak, I'm, I'm telling you, uh, I think this leak's real. This leak is real. It's worth doing a video for guys. I think we've got an image of what the Switch 2 is actually going to look like. I think we've actually got our first glimpse at a Nintendo Switch 2 Joy-Con. The Switch is coming, guys. The Switch is coming. <laughs> Shit just got real. Yes, all aboard the hype train. Choo choo! <laughs> Yeah, so basically, it looks like the Nintendo Switch 2, the console that everybody's been waiting for, it looks like it's going into production. Parts are being collected, the console's being assembled, someone's cooking in the kitchen. Nintendo Switch 2 consoles are being built right now as we speak. We all know that the console's coming sometime in 2025. We don't know when. We don't know when Nintendo's gonna show it to us. We don't know when Nintendo's gonna release it. We do not know nothing. However, I feel like it's close because all these manufacturers, all these third party accessory makers, the lips are getting a bit loose and to be honest, the, the flapping the gums a bit too much. I mean, to be honest, some of them need to be careful that they don't get sued. So basically, there's a website in China, and there's a Chinese website, and someone on that website has posted mock-ups and actual pictures of the Switch 2 and the Joy-Cons. This is exciting me. It's exciting me. Let's get into it. Let's look at. Let, let's. Uh, I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you what the Switch 2 supposedly looks like, ladies and gentlemen. These are the first images of what the Nintendo Switch 2 supposedly looks like. <laughs> look. Look at it. I, I, I mean, to be honest, it's not a real image. Like the PlayStation 5 Pro video that we did last week we don't have an official image because if anyone took a picture of the Nintendo Switch 2 in the production line your life would be over you'd get sacked you'd get sued nobody wants that kind of smoke coming from Nintendo I mean to be honest there's no massive change uh, I mean the system looks a bit more rounded uh, what can I say it kind of reminds me of like uh, the Switch Lite the way the Switch Lite is kind of like rounded and soft, it's soft edges. You can see that the screen is actually indeed bigger, so it looks like we may be getting that 8 inch screen. Um, but yeah, apart from that, that is it. That, that is it. However, I do have something more tangible for you. We actually have an image of a real Joy-Con, a real Joy-Con from the Nintendo Switch 2. We've got a look at the outer casing from it. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the Joy-Con for the Nintendo Switch 2! Look! Ah, look, this is it! Now, 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 let's break it down. Let's break it, break it, break it, break it down. Now, if you look at this picture here, if you look at the Joy-Cons, you can see that although there is a massive change, well, there is, there's quite a few changes, to be honest. Now, let, let's look at this, let's look at this. So, the Joy-Con, I think the biggest thing that I noticed was the shoulder buttons, the SL and the SR buttons. Finally, uh, Nintendo looks to have made them a bit bigger. They look a bit more clickable, to be honest. I don't know how 
raised they will be from the top of the surface, but the SL and the SR buttons currently as they stand on the current Joy-Cons, it's like they're engraved. You have to like really dig in to get them. These look much more clickable. Also, it looks like they've moved the LED lights that were at the top of the Joy-Con. Uh, it looks like that's been moved to the front of the Joy-Con now. And as you can notice, the Joy-Con, the Joy-Con doesn't have a rail on it anymore. So supposedly these Joy-Cons click into play. <gasps> if the Joy-Cons actually make the the switch noise that would be so sick if you actually click the one and it actually made the switch noise but it won't make that noise but anyway these joy cons click into place as opposed to sliding into place that's the magnet that is the magnet that everyone's been talking about there you can see it i think this is what the joy cons gonna be like also one other major difference is at the back it's got another button there and i don't know what that button's for i don't know if it's like a paddle like maybe a paddle maybe it's like a paddle gel them paddles that you have but you can just assign any buttons to it. Stop doing that with your fingers. Um, I don't, I don't know what that is. I don't know what that button is. It turns out that the leaker, whoever's leaked all of this, has also given us an idea of the actual specs of the system. Are you kidding me? Well, I mean, to be honest, this is what they released. I have no idea what this says. It's in Chinese. I'm going to need someone to translate this for me. But this is what they've released. And supposedly there's somewhere within this text is specs on the hardware for the Nintendo Switch 2, I just can't read it. So, read an article on Video Games Chronicle, it says, according to today's images, the Switch 2 will include 12 gigabytes of RAM compared to four gigabytes of the original Switch. It's gonna have support for HDMI 2.1 and 256 gigabytes of internal storage compared to 32 gigabytes of storage on the original Switch. This is fantastic because 32 gigabytes does nothing. At 256, that will do. To be honest, Nintendo managed to keep, always managed to keep their game file sizes down to ridiculously small amounts. Actually, to be honest, um, how big is Breath of the Wild? Breath of the Wild in terms of the Kingdom or something? I don't know, like five gigs. I don't know. To be honest, I'm just literally making numbers up. But anyway, 256 gigabytes internal storage is. Nice, it's greatly welcomed. Thank you, Nintendo. The latest leaks are actually kind of aligning with an older leak that was reported earlier on a few weeks ago. Um, and it looks like it sounded like the console actually might be a bit powerful. It sounds like the console might be a bit beefy. You get me? Listen to this. People on the internet who have nothing to do with their time and are clearly bored at home have been going through tracking and shipping data and have managed to find parts being shipped to Nintendo to build the Nintendo Switch 2. I don't know how they've managed to do it. But reading an article on Video Games Chronicle, it says, members of the Family Boards Forum have been tracking customs and shipping data for some time now in an attempt to find information on shipments being sent between Nintendo, Nvidia, and other parts manufacturers. Someone managed to find <laughs> reference numbers which they think match to Nintendo's components for the Switch 2 madness um but listen to this there's more one listing is for a six gigabyte ram chip of which two will reportedly be used for a total of 12 gigabytes ram uh it's currently unclear whether it will be lpddr5 or lpddr5x ram but it will be reportedly run at speeds of seven point what seven what seven <laughs> What number is that? 7,500 million transfers per second. I'm sorry, I couldn't even read that number. Uh, by comparison, the original Switch had 4 gigabytes of LPDDR4 RAM, which ran at speeds of up to 3,200 million transfers per second. Is that number right? I don't even know. <laughs> Anyway, another listing suggests that the Switch built-in storage will be 256 gigabytes and will be UFS 3.1, which means potential read speeds of up to 2,100 megabytes compared to the original Switch's 32 gigabyte storage, which peaks at 300 megabytes per second. Now, if this is true, this is a nice bump. I don't know what any. Uh, do you know what? To be honest, I don't know what I just read. I'm just looking at the numbers, and the numbers are greatly improved on the original so i'm i'm just hoping that this transfers into something nice you get me i hope that the visual fidelity is nice you get me i hope that nintendo can impress me you get me guys i'm so excited does this mean we'll get a nintendo direct coming soon in september because i've seen a lot of videos of people saying oh we're getting this september direct we're gonna i mean we always get a september direct 
If I say that a Nintendo September Direct is coming every single day, I'm going to be right on one of these days. I feel like that's what people are doing. But genuinely now, with the Nintendo Switch 2 getting closer to production, leaks are bound to happen. There are going to be people on the manufacturing line, on the production line, at work, just with the phone out, taking photos on the, on the DL. Like, people are going to do it. So, Nintendo... You need to get a jump ahead of the crowd, get in front of the line, whatever it's called. I don't know what the expression is called, I don't know what the saying is. But Nintendo, you need to get out now and claim the narrative of the Nintendo Switch 2 because someone's beat you to it. You've been beat to it. We don't even know if this is real anyway. It might not be real. It might not be real. But for now, it looks like everything's lining up. It looks like the Switch 2 is coming soon. Well, and an announcement for it is coming soon. It's on the production line. It's going to come with an 8 inch LCD screen with magnetic Joy Cons with a softer, ergonomic kind of feel to it. And it's going to be powerful. It's, well, I don't know. I don't know. I still think that Nintendo can throw us a curveball and give us a 360 in a box, but we don't know. But yes, that's it. I just wanted to report on this rumour because uh, it's, it feels very real. This rumour feels so real. I'm convinced that a Nintendo Direct's coming soon. I'm convinced that we're going to get some kind of announcement within the next four months. I mean, four weeks. I think we are. We are. Anyway. We'll see. We'll see.